Now let's tour the home screen. At the top left side of the screen, you'll find the weather icon displaying the current conditions and outdoor temperature at your location. The house icon takes you to the location screen where you can edit your location information. On the top right is the Home and Away selection button. This feature is designed to engage a pre-programmed heating schedule based on whether you're at home or away, for example, on vacation. The Home and Away status can also be enabled automatically by configuring the geofencing feature of the thermostat. More on that shortly. On the very top right is the notification bell icon. This icon will indicate if you have unseen notifications. For example, if the GFCI has tripped on your thermostat, you'll find a notification here in addition to receiving an email. Moving down the home screen, in the first section under Devices, you'll see your thermostat displayed. If you have more than one device at your location, all of the thermostats will be listed here. You also have the option to add a new thermostat. Under the section titled Tools, you'll find the Consumption History which provides the combined energy usage of all the thermostats installed at your current location. If you'd like to know the energy use of an individual thermostat, select that device from the list. You'll be directed to that thermostat's dedicated device screen to see this information. The next button is Geofencing, a feature which enables you to activate or deactivate your thermostat based on the physical location of your mobile device. Tap this button to set up your geofencing parameters. The Connected Platforms button is where you'll set up your smart home connection, either to Google Home, Amazon Alexa, or Apple Home. At the bottom left of the screen, you'll find the Home icon, which returns you to the home screen. Next to the Home icon is the Scenes icon. In cases where you have several thermostats installed, consider creating a scene, as this lets you change the temperature and operating modes for all the devices at the same time instead of changing them one by one. Lastly, on the bottom right is the hamburger menu, where you can access account settings for the app. This completes the home screen tour of the app. If you still have questions, please contact our customer support specialists. For more information on Schluter products, visit schluter.com or check out our YouTube channel to view our videos.